Okay, now let me just press and hold on the Galaxy Store and tap on updates. You see, we have got a brand new update for Wonderland module here, but this is the only update you can see right here on the Galaxy Store. Now what I'll do is I will go to the Good Luck application. Now you see we have got this orange dot here. I will tap on makeup section. You see we have got the Wonderland update and we also have one more update here under life up section that is for the multi-star module. Now let's quickly take a look at what is this update all about. First let's check out the Wonderland module. Let me tap on more and go to store here and expand this uh, change log here. You see the latest version is 1.5.16 and in the change log we have got some important fixes for the Wonderland module. The first one is fixed an issue where the wallpaper gets initialized during operation on some devices. This has to do with the uh, wallpaper unlock effect that we get on the lock screen. This issue may not occur on all the phones so on some devices this may be occurring and you can uh, update this module to fix that issue. Then we've got another fix here, fixed an issue where some settings are missing during backup restore through smart switch. Whenever you backup and restore the Galaxy phone through smart switch application, you will be able to backup the Wonderland settings as well. And while you're doing that, there could be some settings which are missing during this process. So this update should fix that as well. You'll be able to seamlessly backup and restore the Wonderland module through the smart switch after this update. Then we have got fixed an issue where the wallpaper is displayed incorrectly or particles do not operate in certain situations. Again, another fix that we have got, then we have got fixed an issue where dark mode is not supported in some UIs. And it says improved usability of some UIs. These are some of the important fixes that we have got for Wonderland module. Uh, I did read some of you guys complaining about this module not working properly on your phone with this update this application should be working fine so go ahead and uh, update this module on your galaxy phone now let me also update this module and let's open the other module that we have got let's open the multi-star change log here I'll go to the store and expand this change log here. You see the latest version is 7.2.19 and uh, we have got some fixes again here and the support for one UI 6.1.1 as well. You see the first point to say is launch a widget in the cover screen. Uh, this is applicable for the cover screen for the foldable devices like the Galaxy Z Fold and Flip. This app is now optimized for one UI 6.1.1 support and uh, we have got uh, app icon batch support as well for the foldables and other bug fixes and feature improvements. Now we have already seen uh, some of the good lock modules getting the support for One UI 6.1.1. Not just for the foldables, even for the regular phones, we have got this support. So let's hope that we get One UI 6.1.1 update very soon, probably this month or uh, in the beginning of next month. Now I have just updated the module. Let's go ahead and open this application and see how does this work. I will tap on this. Now you see we have got a few options here for multi-star. This module enhances the multi-window experience and the Samsung DeX experience. So if you're using Samsung DeX, then multi-star module is a must. You see we have got I love Samsung DeX uh, tab right on top. When I tap on that, we have got a few uh, options here. We can use the DeX on high resolution. As you can see, high resolution for external display, we can enable it. In case if you're using DeX, if you want higher resolution, then you can enable this toggle. Then we have got uh, run many apps at same time. This enables us to run more than five applications to be shown on the connected display play while using Samsung DeX. Then we have got auto open last application and set taskbar and header bar display uh, delay time using this slider. Now these are some options we've got for Samsung DeX and then for the multi-window we've got quick launch of uh, multi-window option. Press and hold on the recent key to quickly access the multi-window. Multi-window screen zoom, multi-focus. These are some of the features which will be very useful if you are doing multitasking on your Samsung Galaxy phones. So make sure to enable these options and start using them. Now uh, let's go to the other module the first module that we discussed that is the wonderland let me open wonderland module here you see using this module we can create our own moving wallpapers and the best part is we can create your different lock screen effect like you can see i will tap on this and I have already created some lock screen wallpaper effects here now let me just tap on set as wallpaper now you see this is the lock screen effect that I get. We've got this cool animation on the lock screen when you unlock the phone or let's say when you uh, turn on the screen on the lock screen. Now let's create a new effect here. I'll tap on plus. You see we can select a wallpaper here. I will select a wallpaper for the lock screen. I'll select this one and I'll tap on close. Now we have got these effect options. You see we have got CRT, pixelate, ripple, peer, warp, edge, blur, hexagon, slice, flip, slide, and the latest one is fluid that they added recently. I selected fluid. You see how smooth the animation is when we select the fluid option. You see it looks pretty cool. 
Now let's select some other effect here. I will uh, select slice. This is my favorite. Uh, let me show you guys how this works. I'll turn it on. You see this is how the slide effect looks on the lock screen. Let me apply this now. Uh, we can also uh, customize this. You see we can increase or decrease the speed of the animation uh, or the effect and we have got uh, tile settings, small or large. Then we've got directions. Let me change the directions here. I will set it to uh, this direction. I'll close this. Now you see this is the direction that we are going to get. So we can change the directions of this effect also on the lock screen. Now let me just tap on download and I'll save and I'll set this as wallpaper. Now you see on the lock screen, this is the effect that I get. Pretty cool, isn't it? So we will be able to customize the lock screen effect using this module. This is a very cool module if you love customization, especially on the lock screen. Now uh, we can also create our own wallpaper. You see when I tap on create your own moving wallpaper, I can tap on new and then here we can select an image from the gallery. Let me select uh, this image here. Now I can tap on this plus button to add image, text, video, particle effect, particle preset. Uh, there was a fix for a particle effect uh, application. Uh, if you remember on the change log it was mentioned let me select particle effect here now you see these are the particle effects that we can get uh, flying flakes I'll tap on flying flakes here we can select auto play or touch effect now I will select auto play and let me show you the preview here you see this is how it looks we have got these flakes uh, falling from the top of the screen that's a pretty cool effect that we have got we can tap on more effect and uh, enable this particular option and then we can increase the motion we can change the movement of these flakes and we can also change the direction we can make it to center or top now we can tap on plus to add a video uh, particle preset text image anything that we want and we can create a beautiful looking wallpaper on this module i have already discussed about this module in detail in the past uh, if you want a separate video on creating some cool looking wallpapers uh, using wonderland module do let me know in the comment section now these two modules on goodlock have got uh, the update let me know whether you have received the update or not drop a comment and while you do that be sure to subscribe to the channel and give this video a like if you find this video useful and if you're interested in this particular wallpaper you can go ahead and download it from the description i have left a link for you guys uh, every video i post will have a brand new wallpaper so go ahead download it and uh, let me know your thoughts about this update in the comment section that's all i have here thanks for watching my name is salyam signing off cheers bye bye